Hi everyone, today is update day and I was just looking on the news page and I saw a new video and if you look at it, it's a new song we don't care. Oh, 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 oh. and it actually sounds pretty good. Oh my gosh, I forgot I was going to switch servers for this video. The last time I bought horses, I couldn't even see the horses because there were so many people. So. I have to find a different server, I think. Should I go to the ranch and see how bad it is? I'm just gonna check it out first because I might not even need to move. Oh, <gasps> it looks a little busy. Okay, it's too busy, I'm getting off. There's so many servers open now. We're gonna do Moraine Cloud. It's probably not even gonna be that busy. We'll see. Oh, <gasps> oh, there's no one here. Unless they haven't popped up yet. This is crazy. On the other server, this was a mob, and this is clear, so you can see the horses that you want to buy. So there are four new horses. Are these the four? Like one, two, three, and four? They all fit perfectly in this little barn. It's so organized, and there's one per stall, and usually at the other barns, they're like squeezing multiple in a stall and it's weird. I don't know how many I'm buying because the first time the quarter horses came out, I didn't even think I was going to buy all four and then I did, but I don't have um, the blue roan. This is the one that I knew was going to be my absolute favorite from the start and I was so sad when it didn't come out in the first, you know, round of horses. Now I'm checking what Star Stable says it is because I might say it's a Sudi Bay, but they might say it's something else. Oh gosh, is this a Sudi Buckskin, really? I am so surprised. I thought this was a bay. <laughs> I'm sure someone in the comments will explain that. Is it sad I never read this? I never noticed how good of stats they have, probably because I don't really race, but like these are good stats. I was hearing that the Arabian right now has some kind of speed glitch on it. This is why I don't care about racing anymore because of weird weird glitches shoot i don't have a name i want to name this horse granola because if you look at the dapples doesn't it look like granola to you it's so basic just naming the horse after what it looks like but that's what we're doing the butt is so dapply yeah you know this horse is a granola the face is so like interesting i kind of want to change the mane and tail because I'm not sure if I like the mane. I just want this Yorvik name to be Breakfast, like Breck and Fist. And then the nickname can be Granola because that just makes so much sense. I mean, I could do something that goes with breakfast. Like I could do Coffee Time. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's what I'll do. This horse kind of looks like coffee anyway, and you put the creamer in it. I think they're adding more names because I never remembered Weaver, Willow. I guess it's been there. See, I don't check the names anymore to see if they've, you know, added more. Now it's time to look at the other horses and see if I want any other ones. This is the Grulo. Uh, the main kind of looks like it's been painted on with a bucket of paint and a paintbrush. The eyes are so cute though, I like the eyes. And then there's little primal markings, or I'm not sure if they're called that, but that's what it looks like to me. Why am I getting stuck in Barbie? She's almost trained by the way, she's so close. This is the flea bit in gray, but the mane is super dark, I guess. Pink muzzles are cute until they get sunburnt. I thought this horse was at Fort Pinta. This is the Flax and Chestnut. Oh my gosh, I actually really, really like this horse. Why does this horse look so cute to me? Now I regret buying Barbie because this horse, this Palomino, looks like a little potato compared to this one. Look how cute this blue roan is. It's so freaking cute. I haven't gotten it yet and I don't even have it in the, in the full zap yet. Oh, she's like, don't look at my horse anymore. Maybe I should set a good example because if you don't know if you should get a horse or not instead of spending all your star coins, maybe you should just wait. This horse looks like a chimichanga, so her name is going to be Chimichanga. 
I'm sorry that you look like a deep fried burrito, but you do. I would seriously name this horse Taco Night, but I don't think you can do that. I'll go in the Flower Girls public Discord server and steal someone's name. I love how someone put facts about their horse so that people could think of a nickname for their horse. Their horse is not good at going up and down stairs. I would not think so. Fireball. I'm naming the horse what Pickle Gabriel Falmore said because that reminds me of Mexican coffee. Why is my whole screen covered up? My channel's for 13 and up, so fireball it is, I guess. Wait a minute. You, you can't do ball? What is this girl on? You can't do ball on this game. You can't do fireball. Okay, it looks like we're going with Chunky Bean or Chimichanga. Great, now I have two more quarter horses. A lot more horses to train. I just can't believe I was so excited to name my horse Fireball, and that's not even an option. Phyllis is trained, Dopey's trained, Merida is sort of halfway. If you're wondering why I have like show clothes for a realistic video in my inventory, it's because that's what I'm going to be working on. Fun times. I feel like Dopey and Granola are going to be really good friends. I just cannot believe that this horse is a bay, but this horse is somehow not a bay. I don't get it. I wonder what kind of main style this horse would look good in. Because this one's not cutting it. I'm not sure why the mane just looks painted on to me. I don't get why this horse cannot put their head up. The braids look really cute, but they're just so formal. You know, sometimes I wish they had this hairstyle, but just on one side. This is a sad scene. We just randomly have a North Swedish out here, and they're like, oh, if we put a little bit of straw on the ground, it'll be fine. Like, it'll be totally fine. The horse will like it. I like how at Starshine Ranch, like, every horse has its own little stall area, and it's all so organized, and then you have this situation. Now I'm gonna go do druid training on my level 1 granola. Apparently this Wolf Hall Inn is actually Wolf Hell Inn in other countries, but in... I guess every place has a different name depending on what language you change your game to. Maybe they didn't put hell in the name because that's offensive here or something, I don't know. I failed probably like three missions so far. It's scary when they start sparkling, like when you're about to go over them. Great, that wasn't that hard. All of the missions seemed so hard when I first started doing them and I was always afraid that I would fail them. I think it's only really hard if you get a bad location, like where you have to actually climb up mountains and stuff. I think this might be one of the harder missions, at least for me. <gasps> oh my god. Oh yikes. Good thing I'm almost done with this. Wait, where's the other one? Oh, I got it. I'm almost done? I hope I don't fail changing lanes. There was one day, I'm not joking, I failed this specific training probably three times. I was going to a different lane and it was saying, like, it was failing me every time and I was so confused. There was the bug at Starshine Ranch where you could do the races over and over and over again there and you'd get XP for doing them. So I kept doing those over and over again. Yeah, that's how I got some of my horses trained. I just did not think this horse would be in my stable. I mean, same with half of the quarter horses that I have, honestly. This one makes the tail lighter. Yeah, I'll go for the long braids on this horse. I bought 66.7% of the quarter horses that came out. That's not as bad as I thought. I was gonna say, like, I never thought I was someone who buys every single horse, like, when they come out, but I guess, I guess I'm starting to get there. Maybe it's because the horses are getting better. I feel like there used to be a lot of horses that would come out and I'd be like, yikes, like, I really don't like that, and I would only pick one horse, and now most of the horses I'm really liking. How many horses do I have total? Should I go count? 
I'm gonna count Barbie as train because she is, I promise, like today. I have 23 horses to train, it looks like. So I have 74 horses now and 23 to train. So I have to train 31% of my horses. That means about 70% of my horses are trained, which is pretty good. Like I usually keep up that number. I don't even know why I care. Why am I even calculating this? Chimichangas, like who cares? I just want to take a picture of this horse at the ranch. This whole place just reminds me of Heartland, even though I've only watched probably like three episodes of Heartland because a girl at my barn tried to get me into it. I did not get into it, but this looks like Heartland, even though I don't really watch Heartland. Look at the dog. I thought it was a loaf of bread. That is the end of this video. I hope you guys are able to get a quarter horse that you want. Thanks for watching. Bye.